There's a fire going on in Webster Avenue in the Bronx, in the East Tremont section of the Bronx to be exact. That ripped through many businesses and many people are displaced. It's a forlorn blaze. And it looks real bad. Fire department is trying to put everything under control. Let's go to the videotape. We're continuing our breaking news coverage of a laundromat fire in Tremont. This year, a live look at what's going on right now on Webster Avenue. Firefighters are still out there working very hard to get this fire out. Thanks for joining us right now. I'm Eric Stelzer. Well, the FDNY is saying that fire is now a four alarm fire. And as you saw in that video, a lot of activity going on in that area. News from the Bronx reporter Amanda Bossard has been out there since the very beginning. She has the latest. Amanda, what's going on? Well, yeah, Eric, this fire continues to burn here on Webster Avenue. This is between East 188th and 189th Street. I'm going to step out of the way and give you a look at the work that is being done by the FDNY members on the scene this afternoon. Uh, if you can zoom in, since there has been a clearing in the thick, heavy smoke we've been seeing throughout the afternoon, you can see in the distance there are firefighters lining up on the edge of the building opposite where the fire is happening at this hour. That is just one one of the ways they are attacking this fire from the air on the ladders and from the ground level. All of this being targeted on the express laundromat on Webster Avenue. Witnesses telling us that about three hours ago, the fire started inside of that laundromat and had spread to neighboring businesses. The Domino's next door uh, from our vantage point also appears to be completely gutted. But at this hour, firefighters remain focused on that laundromat, on putting out the flames. The winds this afternoon, no help to the firefighters working hard here on the scene. Uh, it appears from our vantage point point that the fire spread in the direction that the wind was blowing in throughout the afternoon. We actually spoke to the man who owns the lock and hardware store right next door to the laundromat where this uh, fire appears to have started. That hardware store seemingly unaffected. Actually, people walking in and out of it at this hour. And that is because it is on the opposite side uh, of from where the wind is blowing. So this fire appearing to have spread to at least the dominoes next to that laundromat. Traffic on Webster Avenue hugely impacted by this fire. Uh, much of the stretch uh, beyond East 189th and East 188th Street uh, closed down as multiple fire uh, trucks have taken over the streets, hoses uh, strewn all across the street as firefighters just continue to battle these flames. At this point, there does seem to have been a clearing in the smoke. Uh, the smoke earlier this afternoon and at times throughout this operation has become so thick thick. Uh, it, it, it chokes us on the ground. So imagine those firefighters that are dealing with this uh, almost immediately next to where these flames are, are, uh, are. As you can see, they remain targeted at that laundromat. Uh, at this time, no confirmed injuries, although we did speak to one firefighter who told me that uh, one of his fellow firefighters had been taken for treatment for what he called minor injuries. But because this is such a developing scene, uh, nothing has been confirmed by the FDNY at this hour. But firefighters remain here on the scene, hard at work, uh, attacking this fire from both the ground from outside of that laundromat and from the air with not just ladders but also more firefighters lined up on the roof of the adjacent building attacking from above. Of course, this is a very developing situation here on Webster Avenue as firefighters continue to fight these flames. More information is going to become available as, as this operation continues, but at this hour, this is still an active fire. Firefighters still actively fighting it uh, from a variety of positions surrounding that laundromat, but their efforts all appear to be centered 
on that laundromat. And at this time, again, we are not, uh, no injuries have yet to be confirmed, but we were told by one firefighter that another member of the FDNY had been taken for treatment for minor injuries. Of course, we're going to keep you updated on the latest developments here from Webster Avenue. But for now, I'm going to send it back to you, Eric. Amanda Bossard out there all day. We'll have much more on this story.